Cities in Poland lit up buildings in rainbow colours Monday night in a gesture of solidarity with the LGBT plus community. It's also a gesture of defiance. LGBT rights have been a major flashpoint in the country over the last two years, where politicians tied to the ruling Nationalist Law and Justice Party and senior members of the Catholic Church have argued against what they term LGBT ideology. So last week, several city mayors pledged to illuminate buildings to mark the International Day for Tolerance, although some activists are calling for more substantial support in the face of rising hostility. Hubert Sebecki is with an NGO called Love Does Not Exclude. Now, this is obviously a symbolic gesture, and uh, it's, we, we welcome it when it comes from uh, mayors of uh, smaller cities and smaller towns, especially those who in the past have um, used a very conservative and homophobic narrative. We've already had two years of that the state propaganda machine working 24 7 in order to create this internal enemy called lgbt plus ideology uh, we've never been targeted uh, we've never been scapegoated so intensely as a community as a minority group poland doesn't recognize any form of same-sex marriage and there have even been calls for pride parades to be banned though the capital's mayor did sign an lgbt plus charter Pledging to introduce education about LGBT rights in Warsaw schools two years ago, Tabeki says there has been absolutely no action from the capital's municipal government. Filmmaker Bartosz Staszewski agrees that the light show isn't enough and says tangible change is needed. In 2019, we paid homage to a trans activist who jumped off one of these bridges in Warsaw and unfortunately, I have such terribly bad associations when now the same bridges will simply be rainbow lit and nothing more will happen in Warsaw. No more anti-discrimination measures, just these rainbow bridges will serve the next kid to kill themselves. This is not how it should look.